to our global final celebration and the senior level presentation site for the engineering challenge thrill ride. Each team here today has worked hard through all kinds of twists and turns throughout the challenge season. We ask that you give your undivided attention to the team as they present their solution to this challenge. Please avoid any activity that may be disruptive and we ask that you please silence your personal electronic devices at this time and also keep your hands and feet within the side of the coaster at all times. <laughs> In this challenge, the teams were asked to create a roller coaster and a launching mechanism to demonstrate the speed and distance that a golf ball will travel. Teams will integrate testing of the roller coaster with a team created thrilling event that uses theatrical um, techniques to show the roller coaster's riders experience. The teams were also asked to include two team choice elements that show off their interests, skills, and talents. The team has given permission for video recording, but they would ask that you do not use flash photography. We hope that you're ready to buckle up and remain seated for the next eight minutes of excitement as the ultimate miners present their thrill ride solution. Their team manager, managers are Nick and Jenny. All right. <laughs> group of four engineers and one investor are entering an abandoned mine, looking for a precious metal, altanium. Now this mine was abandoned back in the 1920s due to the lack of altanium, but these engineers believe that there's still some left. The engineers need to convince a greedy investor that it'll be profitable to reopen the mine, but that'll be easier said than done. But don't worry about it. Me and my many rules inside this great book will be watching over them, critiquing any little mistake that they may make. Like here, rule 5,252, chapter 50, section C. You must always serve tacos on a Tuesday. <laughs> but now please, enjoy the show. Well, here we are, the Eltior Mines. It's even bigger than I remember. Look at that mine shaft. It seems to go on forever. It's so dirty, my dress will get ruined. Don't worry about it, close me just fine. Imagine the amount of altanium that could be in this mine. We could strike it rich. This mine does have some promising signs. Well, let's get going. We have altanium to find. Light these two torches, then we'll be off. Here's another part. Thanks. We've built 
first part of the track. Can you guys push the investor down the rails? You're going to do what? We're going to give you a push in the mine cart so you don't have to walk. Fine, have it your way. Now right here, the engineers violated rule 10,252, chapter W, section C. You must always receive valid certifications before entering a mine. But the engineers decide to push on regardless, still looking for the altanium ore. As they go deeper, their track experts are working hard to repair the rails, because the investor will need them for a very different reason before long. It's so dark in here. Did anyone have the brains for the flashlight? Our only light source is these two torches and a lantern. Torches? We're living in 21st century America, not medieval England. Ah! Explosives! Stay back! Wipe your eyes! Uh, don't hold the... Don't hold the dynamite so close to the torch. You might set it off. I know what I'm doing. It's my whole life setting explosives. <laughs> uh, Evan, what are you doing? Sorry! Uh, well, it doesn't seem to be anything major. The mine is collapsing! We're all gonna die! She's right! Everybody run! Stop! I care more than high heels! Help me! I'm going to my guard. You need to get out of here. Right here, the engineers violated rule 2550, chapter 90, section B. You must always wear proper clothing when entering a mine. And they also violated rule 1, chapter 1, section A. You must never explode outdated dynamite inside of a mine. But now it's a race against time. The engineers need to escape with their lives, but that will be easier said than done. This is madness! We're pushing the heavy mark that will build to escape from last mine! You're right! We should leave her here! No! Don't leave her to die! If we get out, I'll pay to return the mine! Just push faster! Hey, but I can't go much further! Neither can I! Just push! No matter how tired you are, just push! Stop! The track is broken! Our rock must have fallen off! Oh, that's the track I said if you can repair it! Hey Liam, come here for the track. A rock found it. It broke it. I'll see what I can do. We have to get out before the whole thing collapses and kills us all. If we can fix the track, we have a chance. That's a big if. The track expert better finish up and hurry repairing the roller coaster. Um, I mean roller coaster track. There, it's fixed. Keep going. How far do you think we have to go? We don't have much time. We got to be close. I'm sure we'll be out. We can't have much further to go. Go, go, go! Oh, uh, that's not good. Push! Push for my life! Push faster! The track is getting really rough. It's almost like a roller coaster ride. <laughs> Look, I can see the light. We must be near the exit. You're right, I see it too. We're going to make it. We will survive. We will live. <laughs> Part of the mine cart, can you get out of here? Let's go. The, the other should already be outside. In the end, the engineers escaped with their lives. Only moments after they made it out, the mine collapsed. After some debate, the investor did decide to let go of her money and reinvest in the mine. It took several years to open up the collapse sections and reinforce all of the others. But finally, after four years of grueling work, the mine reopened. Just a few days after opening, a group of miners struck a large altanium vein estimated to be worth three and a half million dollars. But if the engineers could have changed anything, however, they wouldn't have exploded that dynamite next time. time. Woo!